Hey guys, welcome back to another Assassin's Creed gameplay. I've done all of these synchronizations and now I can moment, get the informant challenge. William of Montferrat has replaced many of the district's honest merchants with men loyal to his cause. He seeks to weaken faith in King Richard by overcharging honest citizens for poorly crafted goods. These corrupt merchants must be removed. Find their stands and destroy them. What the hell do you want? a small thing quick. today, but it's important nonetheless. This bit of paper should prove useful when you finally face William. Okay, so now we return to the Assassin's bu Bureau or whatever the thing is called. I think it's called Bureau. Altair, what brings you back so soon? I've done as asked and armed myself with knowledge. Speak, and I will judge. William's host is large and many men call him master, but he's not without enemies. He and King Richard do not see eye to eye. It's true, they've never been close. This works to my advantage. Richard's visit has upset him. Once the king has left, William will retreat into his fortress to brood. He'll be distracted. That's when I will strike. You're sure of this? As sure as I can be. And if things change, I'll adapt. Then I give you leave to go. End the life of Montferrat that we may call this city free. Right. The feather. I'll return when the deed's been done. Fast forward in memory to a more recent one. So let's go kill our guy now. Finally. I hate the preparations for the assassination. It's like, it's so boring just climbing up and synchronizing so many times and failing at it because like something always, some bullshit always happens. Let's go get the shiny. Oh, I 
Jesus, you got mad. Please be more careful next time. <laughs> Make some of my friend away from God. Let's go in. He must not be of sound mind. Deep down, we are picking all of us. Come here, go gather a target. But God is also merciful, and our past misdeeds may be forgotten. A plague upon his people! We came in peace to the Holy Land to spread the message of our Lord. I beg of you, sir! I beg of you! Just a few coins, please! Maudit voleur! Je te ferai trancher la main! Help me! Anyone! Oh, la ban Trouvez-moi, Je l'ai trouvé! Three thousand souls, William. I was told they would be held as prisoners and used to barter for the release of our men. The Saracens would not have honored their end of the bargain. You know this to be true. I did you a favor. <laughs> oh, yes. A great favor indeed. Now our enemies will be that much stronger in their convictions. Fight that much harder. I know our enemy well. They will not be emboldened, but filled with fear. Tell me, how is it you know the intentions of our enemies so well? You who forsake the field of battle to play at politics? I did what was right, what was just. You swore an oath to uphold the work of God, William. But that is not what I see here. No. I see a man who's trampled it. Your words are most unkind, my liege. I would hope I might have earned your trust by now. You are Arthur's regent, William, set to rule in my stead. How much more trust is required? Perhaps you'd like my crown. You missed the point. But this is nothing new. Much as I'd like to waste my day trading words with you, I have a war to fight. We'll have to continue this another time. Do not let me delay you then. No grace. I fear there will be no place for men like him in the new world. Send word that I wish to speak with the troops. We must ensure that everyone is doing their part. Warn them that any negligence will be severely punished. I'm in no mood to be trifled with today. Yes, my lord. The rest of you, follow me. That's all. 
Well, <clears throat> that didn't go as planned. You can create diversions with dead bodies. Okay, that's actually not that bad of a tip. I know that you are going to murder Richard and claim Appa for your son Conrad. <laughs> for Conrad? My son is an arse, unfit to lead his host, let alone a kingdom. And Richard, the Oncino is no better, blinded as he is by faith in the insubstantial. Akra does not belong to either of them. Then who? The city belongs to its people. How can you claim to speak for the citizens? You stole their food, disciplined them without mercy. Force them into service under you. Everything I did, I did to prepare them for the new world. Stole their food? No. I took possession so that when the lean times came, it might be rationed properly. <coughs> Look around. My district is without crime, save those committed by you and your ilk. And as for the conscription, they were not being trained to fight. They were being taught the merits of order and discipline. These things are hardly evil. No matter how noble you believe your intentions, these acts are cruel and cannot continue. <laughs> we'll see how sweet they are, the fruits of your labors. You do not free the cities as you believe, but rather damn them. And in the end, you'll have only yourself to blame. You, who speak of good intentions. Oh, no, no, no. 
Fuck this, I'm just running. Fuck you guys. Screw everything. Fucking shit! Can you just let me get the fuck out of here? Mask. Yay, solutions. Now let's get back so I can finish this this assassination. Jesus Christ. Oh my god. Go die in a fire, seriously.
news. William of Montferrat is dead, and with him his plans for betrayal. You've done well keeping Akka from his hands. But why now, when the Crusaders require unity most? You could have waited. Waited for what? For Richard to return and discover his schemes? No. It was the perfect time for him to strike. Strange. I was sure he meant to take Akka for Conrad, yet he claimed this was not his plan. You cannot trust the words of a snake, which even in death produces venom. I should discuss this with Al Muallim. Yes, my friend. Make haste for Masia. I am sure he is eager for news. Fast forward in memory to a more recent one. say, Doc? I'm ending the session. No, I'll be right there. You're sure about this? Yes. No. Everything's Denver. I don't see how he could... Of course. I understand. You're in a lot of trouble, Mr. Miles. What's his problem? They're coming for you. Who's coming for me? Assassins. Hey, I had nothing to do with this. Sounds like they're mounting some kind of rescue attempt. Guess you're more important than you realized. Man, things just keep getting weirder and weirder around here. It was bound to happen. What do you mean? That little fight your ancestors started during the Third Crusade? It never ended. You're being held by Templars. Vidix a Templar? There's no way you could have known. They hide it so well. But to answer your question, Vidic works for them. We all do. Abstergo is their company. I thought Templars were old dudes with funny hats who sat around drinking beer and plotting world domination with, like, the lizard people. No. Except the part about world domination, I guess. Look, Desmond, it's complicated. Half the stuff they say about the Templars comes from crazy tinfoil hat-wearing nutjobs. The other half is misinformation intentionally produced by the Templars themselves. But they are the bad guys, right? If there's one thing I've learned since I started working here, it's that there's no such thing. It's all so relative. I guess the best way to explain it is, what they want is good. But the way they're going about it, it's bad. Really bad. What are they trying to do? Lucy. Yes. Miss Stillman, I need to speak with you. Get up here, now! On my way, Doctor. I'm sorry, Desmond, I have to go. You should turn in for the night. The answers to all of your questions are right in front of you. You just have to know where to look. Please, Desmond. I'm gonna get in trouble if I don't leave. And I can't leave until you're in your room. Missed you this morning, Doc. Get in the Animus. OK, 
Okay, so I'm gonna leave it here. Next time, we time when we come back, we're gonna continue with our memory input. We're now at memory memory block five. Um, so yeah, if, if you like this series, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And if you want to see some more series, don't forget to visit our webpage.